Most people don't believe that I'm harmless. They think I'm messing with them. My name is William Girvin, and I've been homeless for about five and a half years. I just couldn't believe it. My name is Ralf Reiner von Albedir, and I'm an entrepreneur. And I used to walk down the road around the corner from this building, and he would be outside having a cigarette. So I just approached him and I said, would you give me a cigarette? And he said, yeah. So we started to talk, and uh, he was uh, very eloquent. But I would see him uh, nearly every night. So one night, I came down carrying a big sheet of cardboard, and he got really confused. <laughs> I was dumbfounded. He's so well-spoken, so well-dressed. It just did not make any sense. It dawned on him that I was actually sleeping around the corner. He thought I lived around the corner. And he told me that he was an artist. Uh, I was a little bit dubious, to be honest. But once I actually had a chance to see his art, it was very apparent that he had a lot of skill. The creative process can be planned. It can be uh, gridded. It can be formed on the canvas or formed on drawings and then transferred to the canvas. And Or I just go straight into a canvas with paint and then it just goes from there. I'm not at all artistic, but uh, uh, the evidence speaks for itself. And that made it apparent to me that this was a story that needed to be told. We're looking to raise $50,000 in order to put on an art exhibition for William right across the street from where he's actually sleeping. And uh, we want to document this with a film, so we're using Kickstarter to raise the money for the film and the event. We think that this is an example of how, with some imagination, one can change a life for the better. You don't make a decision to be a, an artist. You're born to it and you just do it. I mean, no matter how far down you go, when you have purpose, you never lose your sense of self.